In this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix Steam CS2 trading errors, inventory unavailable. If you find this video helpful, please consider to like this video and subscribe to my channel. In saying that, let's just jump straight into the video. Okay, so there's a few different ways how we can go ahead and fix this. So the first way is sometimes a simple restart clears cache or connection bugs. So just simply restart Steam and CS2. So close Steam completely by right clicking on the Steam icon tray and then go ahead and click on exit Steam and then go ahead and relaunch it and try it again. The next fix we can do is check Steam server status. So we can do that by opening up a web browser and go to steamstat.us and then it can let us know if Steam is got any issues here and if it's running all good. So look for Steam community and inventory. If they're down or under maintenance, just simply wait it out until they fix the issues. Fix number three is to set your inventory to public. So if your inventory is private, you or others can't view or trade. So to fix this, open up Steam, click on the Steam logo, then click onto profile. So click on the profile in the top right hand corner, click on to view my profile. And then click on to edit profile. Click into privacy settings on these tabs on the left. And now below here on the right hand side, we've got inventory. Make sure that is set to public and your profile is set to public as well. Also, trading requires Steam Guard to be enabled for at least 15 days. So to go ahead and check if you've got this or enable it, click on Steam, click into Settings. From here, click into Security. Under Steam Guard, we can go ahead and manage Steam Guard. So click onto that and then make sure it's either set to get Steam Card codes from the Steam app on phone or get Steam Card codes by email. If it's currently set to turn Steam Guard off, we need to go ahead and change this to either the top two and then wait 15 days before you can start trading. Now, another thing to note, if you've removed recently added device restrictions, so if you recently logged in from a new device or changed password or email, Steam will unfortunately block trading for seven days as a security measure. Unfortunately, you must wait this time out. Also, we can check if for any VAC or community ban. So being banned in CS2 or Steam can block trading and inventory access. So to check this, click on the Steam icon, then click into settings. From here, make sure you're in the account tab. Under your account, it's going to have VAC status, so no VAC bans on account. But if you've got any bans or anything like that, it's going to appear here. And also, if you're running any VPNs in the background, we should go ahead and temporarily disable them and try and trade after that. 